The 40th United States Congress was a meeting of the legislative branch of the United States federal government, consisting of the United States Senate and the United States House of Representatives. It met in Washington, D.C. from March 4, 1867, to March 4, 1869, during the third and fourth years of Andrew Johnson's presidency. The apportionment of seats in the House of Representatives was based on the Eighth Census of the United States in 1860. Both chambers had a Republican majority. Major events March 30, 1867, Alaska Purchase February 24, 1868, Impeachment of Andrew Johnson May 16, 1868, President Johnson acquitted May 26, 1868, President Johnson acquitted again November 3, 1868, 1868 Presidential Election, Ulysses S. Grant R. defeated Horatio Seymour D. December 25, 1868, President Johnson granted unconditional pardons to all Civil War rebels. January 20, 1869, Elizabeth Cady Stanton was the first woman to testify before Congress. Topic: <laughs> Major legislation. Four military reconstruction acts continued. March 2, 1867, ch. 153, 14 Stat. 428 March 23, 1867, ch. 6, 15 Stat. 2 July 19, 1867, ch. 30, 15 Stat. 14 March 11, 1868, ch. 25, 15 Stat. 41 July 27, 1868, Expatriation Act of 1868, ch. 249, 15 Stat. 223 Constitutional amendments July 10, 1868, 14th Amendment to the United States Constitution declared ratified February 26, 1869, approved an amendment to the Constitution prohibiting the federal and state governments from denying a citizen the right to vote based on that citizen's race, color, or previous condition of servitude, and submitted it to the state legislatures for ratification. Amendment was later ratified on February 3, 1870, becoming the 15th Amendment to the United States Constitution. Treaty February 16, 1868, Treaty of Fort Laramie 1868 ratified April 29, 1868, Treaty of Fort Laramie 1868, 15 Stat. 635, signed Territories organized July 25, 1868, Wyoming Territory organized. Topic: Party summary. The count below identifies party affiliations at the beginning of the first session of this Congress and includes members from vacancies and newly admitted states when they were first seated. Changes resulting from subsequent replacements are shown below in the Changes in Membership. Section. During this Congress, Arkansas, Florida, Alabama, North Carolina, Louisiana, and South Carolina were readmitted to representation in both the Senate and the House. Georgia was readmitted with representation in the House only. Topic: <laughs> Senate. Topic. <laughs> House of Representatives Topic Leadership Topic Senate President Vacant President Pro Tempore Benjamin Wade R Republican Conference Chairman Henry B Anthony 
Democratic Campaign Committee Chairman, James Rood Doolittle <laughs> House of Representatives Speaker, Schuyler Colfax R., until March 3, 1869 Theodore M. Pomeroy R., elected March 3, 1869. Served for one day. Members This list is arranged by chamber, then by state. Senators are listed in order of seniority, and representatives are listed by district. Senate Senators were elected by the state legislatures every two years, with one-third beginning new six-year terms with each Congress. Preceding the names in the list below are Senate class numbers, which indicate the cycle of their election. In this Congress, Class I meant their term ended with this Congress, requiring re-election in 1868, Class II meant their term began in the last Congress, requiring re-election in 1870, and Class III meant their term began in this Congress, requiring re-election in 1872. Skip to House of Representatives, below. Topic. House of Representatives The names of members of the House of Representatives are preceded by their district numbers. Topic. Changes in membership The count below reflects changes from the beginning of the first session of this Congress. Senate Replacements, 3 Democratic, 0 seat net loss Republican, 0 seat net gain Deaths, 1 Resignations, 2 Interim appointments, 1 Seats from newly re-admitted states, 12 Total seats with changes, 16 House of Representatives Replacements, 10 Democratic, 2-seat net loss Republican, 0-seat net gain Independent Republican, 1-seat net gain Conservative, 0-seat net gain Deaths, 8 Resignations, 3 Contested election, 3 Seats from re-admitted states, 32 Total seats with changes, 44. Topic. Committees Lists of committees and their party leaders, for members House and Senate of the committees and their assignments, go into the official congressional directory at the bottom of the article and click on the link, one link. In the directory after the pages of Terms of Service, you will see the committees of the Senate, House standing with subcommittees, select and special and joint and after the committee pages, you will see the House, Senate committee assignments in the directory. On the committees section of the House and Senate in the official congressional directory, the committee's members on the first row on the left side shows the chairman of the committee and on the right side shows the ranking member of the committee. <inaudible> Senate Agriculture Appropriations Audit and control the contingent expenses of the Senate Claims Commerce Distributing public revenue among the states select District of Columbia Education Finance Foreign Relations Impeachment of President Andrew Johnson select. Impeachment Trial Investigation select. Indian Affairs Judiciary Manufactures Military Affairs Mines and Mining Naval Affairs Ninth Census select. Ordnance and War Ships select. Pacific Railroad Patents and the Patent Office Pensions Post Office and Post Roads Private Land Claims Public Lands Representative Reform select Retrenchment Revolutionary Claims Rules 
Tariff Regulation Select Territories Treasury Printing Bureau Select Whole Topic House of Representatives Accounts Agriculture Appropriations Banking and currency Claims Coinage, weights and measures Commerce District of Columbia Education and labor Elections Expenditures in the Interior Department Expenditures in the Navy Department Expenditures in the Post Office Department Expenditures in the State Department Expenditures in the Treasury Department Expenditures in the War Department Expenditures on Public Buildings Freedmen's Affairs Foreign Affairs Indian Affairs Invalid Pensions Manufactures Mileage Military Affairs Militia Mines and Mining Naval Affairs Pacific Railroads Patents Post Office and Post Roads Public Buildings and Grounds Public Expenditures Public Lands Revisal and Unfinished Business Revolutionary Claims Roads and Canals Rules Select Standards of Official Conduct Territories Ways and Means Whole Topic. Joint committees Conditions of Indian Tribes special. Enrolled Bills Ordnance select. Reorganize the civil service in the departments Retrenchment Revise and equalize the pay of the employees of each house To examine the accounts for repairs and furnishing of the executive mansion Topic. Caucuses Democratic House Democratic Senate Topic. Employees Architect of the Capitol, Edward Clark, appointed August 30, 1865 Librarian of Congress, Ainsworth Rand Spofford Topic. Senate Chaplain of the Senate, Edgar H. Gray Baptist. Secretary of the Senate, John W. Forney George C. Gorham, elected June 4, 1868 Sergeant-at-Arms of the Senate, George T. Brown topic. House of Representatives Chaplain of the House, Charles B. Boynton Congregationalist. Clerk of the House, Edward McPherson Doorkeeper of the House, Charles E. Lippincott Messenger to the Speaker, William D. Todd Postmaster of the House, William S. King Reading Clerks, Data Unknown, Missing Sergeant-at-Arms of the House, Nehemiah G. Ordway See also United States elections, 1866 elections leading to this Congress United States Senate elections, 1866 and 1867 United States House of Representatives elections, 1866 United States elections, 1868 elections during this Congress, leading to the next Congress United States presidential election, 1868 United States Senate elections, 1868 and 1869 United States House of Representatives elections, 1868